My name is Kevin Stitt, and I'm the governor of the great state of Oklahoma. Just got reelected to my second four-year term. From a government perspective, we don't create jobs. We just create a level playing field and let businesses go compete. I think manufacturers are looking more and more to states like Oklahoma, specifically on electric vehicles. We know that's where the R&D dollars are headed. And so I'm going hard after battery manufacturers and EV companies because there's a disruption right now in that market and, and it doesn't happen all the time. Hi, my name is Andre Dickens. I'm the mayor of the city of Atlanta. We wanna make sure we have balanced growth. And what I mean by balanced growth is growth that uh, everybody can participate in. It's not just downtown. It's not just in the central business districts, but it's all over the city and that it includes everybody. I created a housing strike force, which is a team of people that they only focus on looking at ways to develop vacant land that we have. All of that land needs to get activated with uh, mixed income communities. I am Amelia Sykes. I am the Congresswoman for Ohio's 13th Congressional District in Northeast Ohio. Creating things like the Buy America program that the president announced during the State of the Union, or even a Buy Ohio program that we've talked about in the state legislature to encourage it uh, here within the state, uh, those are the incentives that we as lawmakers can encourage uh, for us to ensure the supply chains are local and that there is a supply and a demand uh, here locally, uh, and then we're not totally reliant upon other people. Nancy Mace, and I'm the Congresswoman for South Carolina's first congressional district. There's so much, there's traditional manufacturing, there's biotech, fintech, there's all these great, really cool uh, medical technology, just all these great companies popping up all over the place. And there are investors here too, that where entrepreneurs can go to and find funding for uh, some of their opportunities and their startups. And to see the bulk of the jobs, the vast majority of jobs here being created by small businesses is pretty amazing.